Okay, Tara, we are following some breaking news this evening. Take a look at your screen. A child is missing tonight after a shooting left a woman dead. Marco Antonio Jimenez Castro is seven years old. Police say he's about three and a half feet tall, weighs about 50 pounds, brown hair, brown eyes, was last seen wearing a black hooded sweatshirt, shorts, and sandals. And according to officers, he was last seen in a gray four-door vehicle. Police say they noticed he was missing when an officer responded to a shooting at the Sawmill Apartments on Lickridge Court. That's just east of I-465 and I-65. Police say they found a woman inside the apartment dead from an apparent gunshot wound. Also tonight, the scene was just one of many. Four people are dead, including a child after a shooting downtown. Let's get right out to News 8's Logan Gay, live on New York Street. Logan, there's a child missing from this scene as well. Yes, Nina, there is. And I just spoke with a member of the police department and they said they are desperate for information. They are desperate to find this child. They said that there is information about where this child, uh, what car uh, that child disappeared in. And they are desperate for anyone to locate this vehicle. Now, they did say that the child is very young. It's a baby. And she had a picture of the baby. And we will be uploading that picture on our website. Uh, but she says this is a very, very serious night, an emotional night uh, for IMPD and for this community. Uh, two different incidents, two different missing, missing children, and she says they are desperate for information for both children. Now, you can contact IMPD if you have any information, but they also want you to know that if, uh, if you believe that there is someone with a domestic uh, violence or in, in your home, uh, to make sure that you take the safety precautions because they said that this incident is also a domestic incident. Uh, that's what we know so far. Uh, as you can see, it's still a very active scene. I'm going to step aside because I want you to take a look. It's very active. Um, earlier, uh, moments ago, actually, I heard a man crying, saying, my son, my son. Um, he was crying behind uh, the tape over there. You can see that uh, the forensic service agency is still here. Um, it is still very active. Police are on scene. They're going through the scene. Um, they have not been able to release uh, information about um, the names of the victims inside, but what we do know is that there are four people dead inside and that a child is missing and that it's a girl. And so we will have all that information on, on our website about how you can uh, contact the IMPD if you have any information. Like I said, they are desperate for more information. Um, I'm going to remain on scene uh, to continue to collect information and also hopefully talk with investigators uh, live in Indianapolis. I'm Logan Gay, WishTV, WishTV.com, and follow us on Facebook.